So mission while we're here, really, uh, we end up getting called up uh, really state to state. So the state of California calls up the state of Nevada and asks for additional firefighting resources. And so we come out and this is a pretty yearly thing that we'll come out and help out California if they need additional support. And uh, so we train for firefighting in Nevada as well all year, similar to the same training program California has. So we're out here doing wildland fire suppression. So uh, water buckets, we tie, uh, hook it up to the cargo hook underneath the 60 and uh, whatever the firefighters on the ground need, to, they need water placed along the fire line to give dozers time to work in fire line, to uh, help them work with hand lines that they're working in and get some water to cool things down, all of that, whatever the ground crews out there on the fire line need, we help support them with it. There, but uh, I copy that and yeah, I'm, I'm good with it. Um, I did try to make a drive back to you guys again. I just so we've always had a uh, good uh, relationship with California Guard and uh, whenever they need support we're more than willing to help out. They've come over and helped us out in the past so us being in such close proximity, kind of a sister state, like to do help each other out. I think just the fact knowing that we're here and uh, supporting our community is part of our job as the uh, National Guard. Something we enjoy doing is supporting our community. It's an important mission because really uh, we've and you can ask most people that have been firefighting. Um, those ground crews sometimes just need the extra help and because they need that extra help um, you can have it where they're trying to throw away they're trying to throw away uh, uh, brush or they're trying to cut down trees they're trying to throw away uh, uh, firewood that people have stacked up against their house and what we can do is we provide them those extra couple minutes or that extra water to where those spot fires don't start or something that is on fire we can quench it in enough time that they can put a line up around it or they can possibly save a home or things of that nature. So we bring that to the fight to buy them extra time. And uh, we've helicopters, I know plenty of times, we, any of the buddy that's been fighting fires has saved numerous houses with helicopter drops timed at the right time. So that's where it really pays off.